A hearty welcome at a protection of civilian site in Bo, where hundreds of displaced have gathered to meet the United Nations Special Representative of the Secretary General, David Shearer, who is on a day-long visit to hear from the community and meet local leaders. Women and children brave the hot African sun and gather to speak their hearts out. Day by day, life for the displaced has become unbearable and they yearn for a better life. This visit by the head of the UN in South Sudan is a ray of hope for over 2,000 displaced in this state, whose experiences mirror those of 200,000 others displaced countrywide. At a meeting with the area governor, Shira also applauded the efforts of the Jongle state governor towards building peace. The two met to assess the situation on the ground. Uh, we had discussed issues to do with peace building, issues to do with the support of the United Nations mission in the issues of rehabilitation of roads, issues of reconciliation, and uh, issues of humanitarian access. David Shira said the progress made by the state and UNMIS in building a strong road network in the area will increase economic opportunities for the people and, as a result, reduce the need for people to fight. The desire by many people I know to, to leave the POC here in Bor and to, to return to their homes. And we, uh, we, want to try and look, we wanted to look at some of the areas that we can work together to remove the obstacles that will enable that to happen. So if we can remove the problems that will stop people from moving out, whether they be the, the lack of resources they possess, the, the fear of insecurity, um, the fact that this humanitarian activity is going on inside the POC and perhaps not enough outside, the homes that might be occupied by other families, all of these things are obstacles which stop people from returning home. And as the leaders continue to engage, displaced women, men and children hope that their dreams will change with the reality of peace, economic progress and education.